Ah, Gordon, thank you for uh, offering to assist in this difficult situation. It appears you have caused an impending problem throughout the galaxy and beyond. The Zen portals have been left open by the release of the Telnorps, and it appears our uh, friends are in some danger. Naturally, we wish to uh, resolve the situation as quickly as possible and develop the uh, reserves contained within the Zen mineral deposits. But, of course, the well-being of the Zen race must come first. You understand, Mr. Freeman. Unfortunately, some of the aid workers we used in controlling the Zen homeworld took it upon themselves to remove some of the artifacts and the cherished Telnorps, amongst other alien trinkets, were sold to some rather unscrupulous collectors here on Earth. Our agency has located the three Telnorps, and it is just a simple matter of your retrieving them and returning them to the outer regions of uh, Zen. Naturally, you must do this before the Zan impress their might on Zen and compromise the availability of mineral resources. The first Telnor has been located at the Carnival of all places. Apparently, it's part of some larger attraction of Zen artifacts. The second Telnor is in a temple high in the Himalayan mountains. It has become the subject of worship of a group of the fanatics that the agency has had dealings with on a previous occasion. The final Telnorp has been sold into the hands of a rather entrepreneurial gentleman by the name of Fabio Giusatelli, who runs an import-export business not 300 miles from here trading technology not only from Zen, but other <clears throat> off-world races. This man has a personal fetish for the unusual. He collects rare artifacts from many worlds. His collection of military hardware would shame the armies of the Western world. So I've heard. You must locate and acquire these Telnorps quickly, Gordon. We will be observing your progress via satellite relay. Ready for your transfer to Zen once you have them. 
We estimate that you only have three days before the Zan finally cross the border into Zen. Before you leave, Gordon, although absurd, two rumors abound. Apparently, the Zan have become aware of our efforts to stop them and may decide to check your progress at some point over the next few days. Even more ridiculous is the notion that Giusatelli has been told by uh, our agency of the whereabouts of the Telnorps and is planning to use his network of arms-dealing forces to interfere with your efforts and get the other two Telnorps for his own gratification. As I said, Gordon, it's absurd. <laughs> Hey, Mr. Freeman. Please follow me and we'll get you suited up. These are the new Mark VI suits, Mr. Freeman. As soon as you have that on, we can get down to the teleport room. Now, yours is the one on the left. I mean, uh, right. Welcome to the HEV Mark VI protective system for use in hazardous environment conditions. Communications interface online. Atmospheric contaminant sensors activated. Vital sign monitoring activated. Automatic medical systems engaged. Hello. Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? That's odd. If you'll step in, Mr. Freeman, I'll set the coordinates for the Shaolin Temple. Sorry, Mr. Freeman. We didn't want a repeat of that little mishap. Let's see, grid reference A42 slash 37. Oops, uh, sorry Mr. Freeman, I'll try that again. <laughs> I never could get those coordinates right.
damage.
go. Ah, Gordon. Well done for convincing our Himalayan friends to part with their Telnorp. The carnival seems to have had a natural this. disaster, Mr. Freeman. I have faith that you will offer all the aid required. Sorry, Gordon, but I am being on duty. Find me later and I'll buy you a shot of vodka. Thank God you've arrived. Health and safety guy, da? Yeah, the problem is down at the new flying saucer right past the big ferris wheel. The damn thing just went totally nuts. There's lights flashing everywhere and there's this green blobby stuff kind of floating in the air. They told me to climb up and take a look. But there's no way I'm going to be getting near that thing. We've evacuated the park as per emergency procedures. But if you ask me, it's just another one of these electrical shorts we keep getting. You you were there last week, da? I am thinking I remember it. Anyway, it is strange about where it happened. The new flying saucer? It has different markings from all the other attractions from Zen. I am so good it scares me sometimes. You must take this seriously.
Can we do this later? Sorry, sir, I must be staying at my post. Find me later and I'll buy you a shot of vodka.
Scared.
holding the damn pool. Oh dear God, that electrical short has stripped out of a holding gun. There's been screeches all over the park. You got the damn pool. What? Oh dear God. That electrical short is stripped out of a holding box. There's creatures all over the top. Agreed. Now let's get the hell out. Cannot be
Open fire, Gordon. Open fire. I know. I told you that the intrepid Mr. Freeman will collect all three Telnorps into one place. Yeah, well, he better. Mr. Jusatelli said to tell you that he's paying good money for these damn months. Don't ever tell me my business again. I've told you everything is under control. Of course, if something were to happen to the satellite, but of course it would take a powerful weapon to destroy it. Thank <laughs> you. 
Sir, all the little butterflies, they are free, and you have survived. I hope you left the toilet area as clean as you found it. The administrator, the radio dump, is coming now, so you had best be gathering your things. We've had a little trouble with the door recently, but I can open it for you manually. That did not sound good. arrange your transportation to Zen, where the Telnops should already be waiting. Entered channel. Hey, hey, you're listening to me.
Thank <laughs> you. 